What's going on? To jump, press jump. Press it again while you're in the air to jump even higher. You get points for just about everything you fight or eat. Hack pellets are everywhere. Running over them adds to your score. And for every 250 you collect, you get an extra life. Chop all the vending machines and recycling bins you find. There are valuable things inside. Each piece of food you eat restores one point of health. Slimetanium is rare and valuable. Each one you get recharges your health and gives a temporary extra health to boot. <laughs> Pack prizes are worth a lot of points. If you find and collect all three in a level, you get a big bonus. You can replay levels to try and get a higher score. To attack a ghost, press chomp. Not that I need to tell you how to eat. <laughs> we don't stand a ghost of a chance. Sleeping ghosts don't attack you. Just start chomping when you see them. It'll get you to places you can't run or jump to. A plasma sphere temporarily protects you from all attacks. Not bad. When you pick up an arcade token, it adds a temporary score multiplier to all points you earn. Blackberry pies are really tasty. They also give you back all your health and give you an extra life. When you're in normal pack form, press special to scare nearby ghosts. When they're scared, ghosts don't attack you, and eating them gets you a lot more points. If you chomp a bunch of scared ghosts in a row, you also get valuable bonus pickups. <laughs> To recharge your boo attack, you have to eat some non-scared ghosts. Check your ghost meter. When all the ghosts are flashing, you're ready to boo. Steam vents let you travel long distances. Just step into them and they'll do the rest. Huh. 
When you see a power berry, chomp it! Power berries change you into your other pack forms, each of which has its own special powers. Activate buttons by stepping on them. Activate pull switches by chomping them. At the end of every level, you'll win a bronze, silver, or gold medal. The more points you score, the better the medal. Excellent work, my boy. You should be ready to try out your basic skills in the real world now. All of my plans to take over Pac-World are always spoiled by that little Pac-Rat. I blame the two of you! Surely it's more his fault than mine. Is not. And don't call Lord Betrayus, Shirley. Shut up, you two! Ugh. If only I could get my hands on the repository that holds the Pac-World bodies of all the ghosts in the Netherworld. If I had my body back, this would all be so easy! Yes, sir. I'm sure that would make all the difference. <laughs> of course, you have also failed every time you try to steal the repository. Ow. That's what you get for stating the obvious! Perhaps it's the whole you stealing the repository thing that is the problem. If you had something of value to offer in exchange, perhaps Peck would actually steal the repository himself and give it to you. Of course! What a brilliant plan! I'm glad I thought of it! I know just what to offer him! And I think I know how to make it happen. First, I need to distract the Lemonhead while we plan this out. Oh, I know! The giant Grindertron robot! I have just finished repairing it! It is ready to unleash on Pacopolis! Again! Perfect! Now, let me tell you the rest of my idea. Space, Apex, the repository, the body! Well? Needlessly complicated as always, sir. Very 
easy. Thank you.